What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. This video, this is a tutorial video about how to print laser checks and how to set the printers. So now you can, we have a new option where you can set uh, a printer just for the checks. Or if you, if your printer has multiple trays, you can set an individual tray just for the checks. But before we start that, I just want you to know where to you get your checks from. You gotta go to vistaprint.com and if you don't know where just go to checks right there and click on uh, buy checks which is going to take you to vista print it's going to bring you here you gotta you gotta have an account so make sure you log in with your account and go to design and you gotta pick the first one and then you can pick the colors that you want and then this is how much you can buy 1440 which is really cheap 1000 check 440 dollars and you can just you know type your you gotta type your 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 information and your account number and routing number and all that it's really simple but make sure the address that you type that's where they will send it to so make sure of that so once you buy your checks right um you gotta come in here it's gonna ask you to start your checks well you, you gotta start with the check number you can always update that number uh, going forward you cannot go backward but yes you can update that number so once you set it up and after that you click on setting right here and then you can select the printer so you can select a different printer just for just for checks so that way you load your checks because that was the problem before is we have to load the check every time and it's hassle and our job is to save you every second of your life and then they, they count so if you can print checks so quickly why not do that so set that, uh, set your printer right here. If, if you have to, make sure you have a different printer because you don't want to mix it up and set the printer right here. If you have a, uh, if you have a printer that has multiple trays, uh, you have to do two things. Number one, you got to go to uh, file and then printer setup and find your, go to printers and scanners and then go to your printer and you got to go to printer preferences and you gotta look for paper source look for paper source you need to set that because you know the checks and the papers are the same size so the your printer doesn't know which one it's gonna choose so it's gonna choose any so if you set the paper source to like like I have two I have I have three but number one I, I don't use it so number two and number three are exactly the same I wanted to use number two for checks and number three for papers so I set number three for the papers that way that's the default and then once we do that, we go to checks right here. And this is like kind of a hidden feature because it's, it's, it's a headache basically if you don't know what you're doing. But I'm showing you how to do it. Um, just click on settings and then select the printer and like underneath uh, where the printer just click like five times. And it's going to give you the option to select your paper source. Click on the paper source and select number two. So number three, I selected for my, my invoices and estimates and everything else. And number two, it's only for the checks. And now I just load my checks to tray number two and I'm all set. If you don't want to, if your printer doesn't have multiple trays, then stick, buy an additional printer and you'll be all set. Look how awesome it is to write a check. Just print, you know, you can even save the name so you don't even have to type them. And then let's say I want to give $1,050. And then I can type in the memo right here, issue a check, and then print. And it's simple as that. It's crazy. It just printed a real check right now. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, take advantage of this. Stop handwriting checks, man. A printed checks versus handwriting checks, it looks like it's a fake check. Start printing checks. Start saving money. Start saving time, which is more important. And more importantly, look professional. Until next time, thanks for watching.